WannaCry 101 is the biggest malware attack that the world has experienced. More than 200,000 computer systems across 99 countries have been affected due to this malware. According to the recent reports, WannaCry has targeted national health services in England and Scotland. Russia has seen the most number of infected computer systems. The malware also spread in a university computer lab in Italy, according to this tweet. WannaCry is basically a ransomware that is quick to spread once any computer in an organization is affected. The WannaCry program then encrypts files on the computer, blocking users from accessing critical information and asking for a payment of $300 to $600 in bitcoins to unlock files on each affected computer. Experts believe that the malware takes advantages of a vulnerability in Windows PCs that was identified by the United States National Security Agency. Although Microsoft had patched the flaw back in March, many users, IT departments and organizations did not apply the update to their systems, making them open to the attack. As far as India is concerned, there is nothing much to worry, as the Computer Emergency Response Team has said that very few reports are reported from our country. The team has released a list of all the file extensions that are being affected by WannaCry. The governments across the world, including India, are taking steps to educate users about ransomware. Experts at CERT are doing their bit by giving a set of preventive measures that users can adopt to avoid the entry of WannaCry malware. First of all, users have to patch their Windows computers as mentioned in Microsoft's security bulletin MS17010. Microsoft has also issued a patch for unsupported versions such as Windows XP, Vista, Server 2003 and Server 2008. The next thing is that the users should deploy the antivirus protection and block spam. The users have to make sure that they do not open any attachments which are present in unsolicited emails. All the security measures have been listed at the official website of cyberswachatakendra.gov.in. Let us know in the comment section if you also have faced any such kind of an issue. Thank you for tuning into Digit. For more videos, subscribe to our channel and don't forget to hit the bell icon to get all the updates.